I can't believe how time flies. I just came back from a big trip to South Korea and Japan. I've been thinking a lot about what I want to do this year and I feel like I've been living so long in kind of pilot mode when you move countries and you're by yourself a lot you have to like keep going all the time and you never realize that you need to kind of enjoy each moment because you don't know if it's going to be like the last moment in that either apartment or like you know like with those friends and one of my resolutions this year is to enjoy a bit more each day and not be so anxious about the future and just like enjoy the present a bit more. I've been watching a lot of my old vlogs and I'm really glad I did film all my moves and every big moment in my life and I hope I never stop doing that because it actually helps me a lot and yeah so I'm gonna try to do that more and yeah, hopefully it goes well. So yeah, just do that. <laughs> Ground floor. I love this store. They have everything. This is actually one of my favorite snacks. It's so, so good. I love this. Oh my God, all the Italian chips are everything. This is what I was looking for. Oh, it's so, so good. <gasps> Oh, and they have prawns as well. I think I'm really craving the octopus. Okay, I got the snacks. Now I need to go and get the flowers. They look so good. Don't know if I should put them like this or no, I think, yeah, I think it looks better like that. Okay, just made my coffee in this little mug. I went to a little bakery here. Well, it's a coffee shop, but it also has like a bakery. They do these muffins. So you have a flat white muffin and like mixed berries. I think it varies each week or something like that. But what they usually do all the time, it's called cruffing. So it's a mix of a course croissant croissant like in france and a muffin so you can see it's literally a croissant in the shape of a muffin <laughs> isn't it so cute it's so nice so i'm gonna have this with my coffee that's really nice that's so good hi Welcome to my bathroom. I don't know if you can hear, but I have my laundry on. It's 6 p.m. So that means it's time for my skincare and getting ready for bed because I am a grandma that loves to go to bed early nowadays. I'm gonna start my skincare. I wanna show you what I do. My nighttime routine, it's um, pretty, oh, this is not great. But yeah, it's pretty simple. Yes, so what I'm gonna do first is I'm gonna take my makeup off. So usually first I do an oil cleanser to remove my first layer. So yeah. Okay, so that's most of the makeup off. And now I'm gonna do a second cleanse. This is also a Korean brand. This is so good. I think the trick into good skin is a good cleanse, like a double cleanse every night. I have a bit of water in my nose. Look at my toilet paper. I got it on Christmas, like a bunch of this. Oh, I think they're so cute. So, next, I'm gonna do the toner. I also use a Korean brand. I just let that get absorbed. I just wait and wait and wait. Then, I've recently started with the toner pads. I have a few spots there that I want to get rid of and then yeah, you just wait for that to make effect and the rest I'm gonna put it on my chin because I have a few spots there too. I usually wait 5 to 10 minutes for that to actually make effect. 
Now I'm just going to put this 100% plant derived, it's quite late, which is a natural oil. Just tap it all over my face and my neck. I was so ready to go to bed, but the laundry is still going and oh, I really want to go to sleep. By the way, it's 6.30, so what am I doing? <laughs> okay i'm just gonna wait i think i'm gonna watch an episode of some this k drama that i'm watching which is welcome to some diary something like that it's really nice i can't wait to go to sleep it's friday night i am currently walking in Notting hill because i'm going for dinner with my friend megan it's been like two months since we've seen each other i'm very excited to see her i haven't seen her since i left for South Korea. Oh, it's so nice here. Yeah. Like all the houses and everything. I love it. For the past few months. We just finished the dinner. It was so nice to catch up. We had such good food. That was one of my bucket list restaurants to go to. It was really nice. It's really nice. Like, I will definitely come back and I highly recommend that restaurant in Notting Hill. Uh, so yeah, and tomorrow I have brunch with friends in Chelsea. So I'm excited for that, but I'm just very tired right now. <laughs> so yeah, going home. It was a very nice evening. Good morning. It's Saturday morning and I so cold today i forgot my gloves and i'm freezing but yeah we're going to have some lunch with two of my friends at this really cool place that i've never been before i think it's like lebanese food so yeah i'm excited to go there and i will try to show you around So I'm back from seeing my friends. It's been so nice to to spend time together. I haven't seen them in two months. Yeah, we met for lunch and then we went for a coffee in the set and then we decided to go to a pub and just have a few beers and just chat about life. I was just so ready to go back home and I don't know, like me a year ago, or like a few years ago, I would feel so bad if I didn't have plans like a Friday night or a Saturday night. But nowadays I just prefer to see my friends and just have a nice lunch or coffee in the afternoon and spend the daytime together instead of just going out for some drinks in the evening and just being up so late and going home late like i prefer to know like be in bed with a nice hot chocolate and watch a i don't know a tv show and just enjoy that kind of night i do enjoy going out every once in a while in the evening but so I prefer to be like a bit cozier at home, especially in winter when it's so cold outside. And yeah, tomorrow it's Sunday and it's the farmer's market. And I haven't been to the farmer's market in two months. And I'm so excited because I go every single Sunday morning and I buy from the same small businesses every single Sunday. So I know them and... It's going to be so nice to just see them, to just say hi to everyone after so long. Just buy over all the things that I usually buy every Sunday. It's just like a nice little routine that I have. Um, I just love a good farmer's market. So I'm excited for that. And then after the farmer's market, I'm going to meet a friend for coffee. So I'm very excited about that. I haven't seen her in a while. So I haven't seen anyone in a while. Like, so it's been such a nice um, weekend where I can like catch up with people and just overall um, get back into my little London life. After a while of not being here, I started to 
appreciate more my little routine and just the community that I created here that it took me so long to find nice friendships and you know it's hard when you start over in a new country and um the older you get it's hard to create bonds with people and just trying to find people with the same interests as, as you and it takes time and everyone's busy obviously and it's just it's hard so I'm very glad and I'm very happy with the life that I've created here in London so I, now I'm going to take a nice hot shower it's 9 30 p.m and I'm extremely exhausted yeah I'm excited for tomorrow and I'll film it if I can okay I am on my way to meet my friend Agnes for coffee. Um, I went to the farmer's market and it was so nice to go back, uh, but it was so busy. So I just said hi to everyone I know there and came straight to Clapham. It's going to be nice to catch up and just have good food. It's so cold today. Oh my god. <laughs> okay, I'm back home. It's night time. I'm in my pajamas and I took my makeup off and everything. Um, I had such a lovely time with my friend Agnes. She is such a sweet soul. I love her so much. And yeah, now I'm back home. I had some dinner and... I'm just so ready to go to bed uh, but yeah it's been such a great week I'm so so happy and it was a perfect first week back in London I hope I can have some sort of consistency with this type of videos I think it's great for me to just look back and see how my life was at this stage of my life <laughs> Alright, see you next time. Bye.